Okay, today we're talking about the unboxing of the Testo 560i. This is the full kit which includes the scales and the digital control valve as well. So if we open the case up, what we can see in this side, clearly held in, you've got the Testo 560i scales. In this side of the case, if you want to do the Velcro, you've got your certificate of conformity, you've also got the guide sheet for the use of the device, and then you've got your Testo 560i um, intelligent scale and also a space for spare batteries. We take this unit out, you've got your process connections for the charging hoses to go on to, and the on and off button on the device. Now if we look at the scale, we can see very rugged, nice aluminium die cast frame, recessed on and off button at the top, 100 kilo weight um, limit on the platform, and on the reverse we just see the cover for the batteries and obviously the four clear feet. As you can see, all fits into the case, nice and snug, secure, it's going to look after the instrument when it's out on sight, and the whole case holds up and zips together. So now we're going to look at the connection of the Testo 560i intelligent scales to one of our digital manifolds. So first thing you need to do is obviously make sure the scales are switched on. And on the digital manifold, switch the instrument on. And once the screen's ready, you need to go to the menu and select the measuring mode for refrigerant charging. And you then have options of manual charge recovery or the auto charge by weight or auto charge by super eat or sub -call. But if we look at the basic manual charging recovery and we select that as a function, you can see the manifold is asking to pair with the 560i scales. We allow that. What we now see in the bottom of the manifold screen is the weight from the scales. We can tell that connection has now been established because on the scales the indicator light has gone green. And what we can now do is apply some weight to the scales and we will actually see the weight on the manifold. Now we're going to look at how you pair the Testo 560i digital scales with just the app. So this is for somebody who maybe hasn't got a Testo manifold but still wants to use the functionality of the Testo scales. So very simply we switch the scales on and then on your smartphone, this can be either an Android or iOS device, you select the Testo smart app. And then we can clearly see that you can look at the weight from the scales direct onto our app. In this short video we're going to be looking at the connection of the Testo 560i scales to the manifold but also we're going to be looking at the screen mirroring from the manifold which gives you a second screen option. So first off we will switch on the Testo 560i scales and switch on the manifold. And on the manifold we're going to go into the measuring mode and we're going to select refrigerant charging and in this case manual charging and recovery. We'll see that this manifold itself will prompt us to connect to the scales which will allow and now what we will see in the bottom here is the connection from the scales and we'll just zero these scales out as well so we've now got zero weight what we can now also have is on the Testo smart app is a Bluetooth connection from the manifold through to a smartphone or tablet and what this will allow the user to do is have a second screen remotely on site it means they can leave the manifold connected and then actually have this as a secondary device to view. And we can clearly see here now we have the same information we have on the screen. So you have your low side and high side pressures. And at the top we have the weight from the scales. So you can walk away from the manifold up to 100 metres with your phone and still have visibility of what's happening with the system. In this short video we're going to explain how the Testo 560i digital scales can be used in conjunction with one of the Testo digital manifolds but also we're going to be looking at the intelligent valve concept that allows truly automatic charging of a refrigeration or air conditioning or heat pump system. So first thing is we'll switch on the scales and switch on the manifold. Within the manifold we need to go into the menu and on measuring mode we will select the refrigerant charging option 
but now instead of having a manual charge recovery we have three options either an auto charging using the filling valve by weight or an auto charging using the filling valve by either superheat or subcooling but we'll just select the charging by weight what we need to do now is to switch the valve on and the manifold now is connected to both the scales and the valve via Bluetooth. We now have a configuration screen that opens that allows us to select the type of refrigerant but also more importantly the target charging weight. In this case we've just put in a charging weight of 0.3 kilos. If we now select that we go to the screen that is ready to start the auto charging. You see we have a start command here. The valve at the moment is shut and is waiting to be operated. If I now push the start command, you can see the valve is activated. And what will happen now is the manifold will auto control the valve to achieve that target filling.